Manchester United have reportedly revealed that they could look to sell Mason Greenwood in a matter of months. Greenwood, 22, was loaned out to Getafe by Manchester United last summer. The star striker has not featured for United since he was suspended after being arrested on suspicion of rape and sexual assault in January 2022. All charges were subsequently dropped with the Red Devils suggesting that he recommences his career away from Old Trafford. But last week, new United co-owner Sir Jim Ratcliffe refused to rule out the possibility of Greenwood returning to the club. Now, the English giants have reportedly revealed that it remains their expectation Greenwood will be sold in summer, according to Mail Online. Read more in football Ian the Doc, ex-Prem League star Hamza Chowdhury arrives at court charged with drink driving Ronwo Ronaldo banned for making offensive gesture in Saudi Pro League and hit with fine Greenwood's United contract expires at the end of next season and the club have an option to extend it by a further 12 months. This would significantly increase the fee they could demand in the event of a sale. The Red Devils Academy graduate has attracted interest from Barcelona and Atletico Madrid and United could well cash in this summer. Sir Jim has since hinted that the 22-year-old could be handed a path back to Old Trafford. Most read in football Bay High Eric Dia to sign for Bayern Munich his permanent option is triggered double bubble transfer recommendations for GW26 Watkins Bowen justifiably popular star Bam Pogba breaks silence after being hit with four-year ban that could end career Ronwo Ronaldo banned for making offensive gesture in Saudi Pro League and hit with fine however, it was also acknowledged that Ratcliffe's words were ambiguous, given the need to find a buyer and negotiate an appropriate transfer fee. Speaking for the first time since completing his £1.03 billion purchase of a 27% stake in the club, which includes control of football affairs, petrochemicals magnate Ratcliffe gave a remarkable insight into his ambitions and thoughts. Mason Greenwood is officially unveiled with new club Getafe after Man United exit the Red Devils Supremo claimed that a fresh decision will be taken on the future of Greenwood. Ratcliffe said, we will make a decision. I don't know if he, Greenwood, could still have a future. All I can do is talk about the principle of how we will approach decisions like that. Is he the right type of footballer? Are we happy with that? Is he a good person or not? He, Greenwood, is a Manchester United footballer and we are in charge of football. So the answer is it's quite clear we have to make a decision. Greenwood's potential future options Mason Greenwood's long-term future in football still remains unclear. Greenwood is out of contract in 2025 and is largely expected to leave Old Trafford in the summer. But the star has enjoyed a good season at Getafe and has been linked with other clubs. Here are his four main options. Stay at Manchester United Greenwood's United career was largely thought to be over when he moved to Getafe on deadline day last September.
but new co-owner Sir Jim Ratcliffe has since hinted that the 22-year-old could be handed a path back to Old Trafford. Ratcliffe left the door open for Greenwood to play for United again after saying a decision needed to be made. Sir Jim said, he's on loan obviously but he's not the only one. We've got one or two footballers that we have to deal with and we have to make a decision on so we will do that. Barcelona the Spanish giants are understood to have been monitoring the former Manchester United star all season. Greenwood has reportedly told his advisers that Barcelona is a dream move. One source told Sunsport, Barcelona want to sign Greenwood, and he wants to move there. The next step is for the clubs to come to an agreement. Barker even said to be willing to offer the 22-year-old Lionel Messi's legendary number 10 shirt to convince him to join. Atletico Madrid The Red Devils Academy graduate has also attracted interest from Atletico Madrid. Marca previously reported, via Estadio Deportivo, that the club have held talks with United as they step up the pursuit. Atletico had a chance to take in Greenwood up close during their derby meeting in mid-December. Whilst the former England international didn't get on the score sheet during the testy 3-3 draw, Getafe were able to frustrate the Champions League side and escape the Metropolitano with a point. Make Getafe move permanent Greenwood has been building back his form as a regular starter at the La Liga side. He seems to have been enjoying his football and is thought to be interested in staying in Spain long term after settling in the national capital. Greenwood has scored seven goals and provided five assists in 25 appearances. But several unnamed Italian clubs have also been linked with making moves for Greenwood in the summer. However, Sir Jim is said to want to speak to the fans group and other senior club officials about Greenwood before making a final decision. He is said to have tasked a team of his trusted advisers to make resolving the matter a priority between now and the end of the season. The source said, Jim Ratcliffe wants it resolved by the end of May so they can go into the summer knowing what's happening. There's interest in Mason from Barcelona but no move and no talks will happen until the end of May. Sir Jim also suggested his preferred option would be a new £2 billion replacement stadium for Old Trafford although rebuilding the club's 114-year-old home is still on the agenda. Greenwood was sent out on loan to La Liga side Getafe in September last year. His time in Spain has so far proven fruitful, having scored seven goals and provided five assists in 25 appearances. Meanwhile, Ratcliffe has also refused to close the door on fellow outcast Jadon Sancho.
Read more Sun S-T-O-R-I-E-S-L-O-V-E-D up Love Island's Callum and Jess hit back at split rumors cozying up on date night Dave streams Harry Bikers star Dave Myers bittersweet last post before death aged 66 Sancho is now back at Borussia Dortmund on loan after a huge fallout with manager Ten Hag meant he was banished to the youth team in September. But his time in Germany has so far proven underwhelming, with the Red Devils gaffer seemingly vindicated for now.